What's good, Rome Squad? You already know what time it is. We got Mr. Bean. We got Vegetable Man in the house. You feel me? Uh, Geyser, Geyser, Show Illuminati in the house. You feel me? Other than that, today's video is on Kyrie. You feel me? Kyrie, you stay strong, my boy. Do not fall for that nonsense, my guy. None of that nonsense, bro. It's not worth the bag sometimes, bro. You got to respect yourself. That's what people fail to realize. I mean, yes. You need to feed your family, but hey, you can do that in many other different ways, bro. And guess what? That, you know what I'm saying? It ain't about the bag just because you're getting 15 million. Like, that's cool, bro. Like, oh, your family's set for life. All right, yeah, I get it, bro. Dude, sometimes you got you to gotta have morals, bro. You got to have standards, bro. And when people get to walking all over them, it's, you ain't got none no more. You feel me? So, hey, you got to stand strong, stand true. You feel me? But, hey, Kyrie doing that, but... I think he might just get a trade somewhere else that doesn't have the mandate as serious. So then he can go to Brooklyn or he can go to New York and play the Nets, which is crazy because Bradley Bill doesn't have his vaccine and he just played in New York. You feel me? So that's like, what, bro? Like, you know what I'm saying? So he just probably going to move somewhere else. I hope he doesn't go to Portland because Kyrie on Portland is just weird, bro. Just leave Damian Lillard and CJ McCollum, the wannabe splash bros, you know what I'm saying? They would never touch Steph Curry and Klay Thompson, bro. They're not the same shooters. Dame is a Dame is a good shooter, you know, but he's not Stephen Curry good, bro. Or clutch at Stephen Curry and whatnot, bro. Like, I'm just saying, like, that's it, you know? He always he, he always loses Stephen Curry in the playoffs for all you little bandwagoners talking about oh damn damn you know what I'm saying I heard you when the building gazer gazer nature so when the building man double party party in the building <laughs> hold on put this Dewey back on man good vibes today dog I said oh y'all. So listen, I'm in my closet right now, so y'all know it's time for me to vent. So first thing first, I want to get straight to the point. I want to talk to you like I'm FaceTiming you. I hope you've been taking care of yourself. And focus on your fucking self. We in the matrix. Focus on yourself. A lot of stuff is changing right now. Focus on yourself. Every time I come back here, I want y'all to know I'm not go. I don't know how long they gonna let me keep posting these videos. I just got off suspension. They banned Sheesh. my New York video that I dropped for y'all. New it York, four hundred thousand views in two days. They banned it. Ah. They really then banned me for a week. I don't really know to like they monitoring my channel. The energy it don't even feel the same. I just feel like I'm just being watched. Anybody that's un is just being attacked by <laughs> the whole world. He said. <laughs> Two months ago, they banned me for 90 days, and then I put the dispute in, and I had to wait for them to answer the dispute. Then they changed it to a week. Earlier this year, they tried to pay me to promote. I think it was like 20000 dead ass. So if they trying to pay me that much money, I can only imagine how they trying to, how much they paying these singers, rappers, and bigger influencers. They tried to pay me to promote it, and I did it. Instead, I came out talking about that the video was called Coming. Or it's coming. It was at the beginning of the year. I told y'all it was a new thing coming and y'all was going to be tough. And it happened. And they banned that video and then they had banned me. But I wasn't even on YouTube at the time. I returned to my main channel. Solomonati. I returned to my main channel two weeks ago. I posted a regular ass little kitty 2K gameplay. No face cam. It was just the gameplay of me just talking. They trended the video number 14 in the world. Why? You know how many videos with millions of views that was posted that same day, just like mine? My video didn't have a million views. It had 200,000. I have posted IRLs, basketball, 1v1s, woke videos to change your life. None of them never trended. But as soon as I returned to my main channel and I post that 2K, y'all trended. Y'all wanted me to keep posting it. Two days later, I'm like, okay. Two days later, I returned to Spiritual Soul. They banned me. <laughs> Oh, shit. They banned me on Spiritual Soul and then banned my video. We in a war, y'all. It's nothing you can do on eight platforms. 
we in a war. Y'all see what's happening to Kyrie right now? I dropped a video about Kyrie. In 2019, I told y'all Kyrie Irving is like the only woke NBA player. Like, I know he do matrix shit. The, the, the Black Lives Matter and all the stuff that he's done. I know. But right now, what the fuck I seen? I was in his Instagram live. What I seen? He's not going by that script no more, y'all. Kyrie Irving is all alone. And he need the chosen ones. The nigga is literally not going by the script. Kyrie Irving already know his purpose is bigger than basketball. Kyrie know what's really happening all around the real world. He said it in his live. He said he don't want to have nothing to do with this agenda that they have going on. He said it's bigger and more important things going on than basketball. He said this, but yet all you got is these paid puppets that try to get paid. They try to pay me too. All you got is these paid puppets talking about sports. They distracting you from the real world. They distracting you from the real truth. Now they trying to use Kyrie as a distraction. Talking about he losing all his money. They keep talking about how much money he's losing, bitch. It don't <laughs> nigga fuck. We got our souls. Facts. Fuck that, that. Like, dude. That's what I was trying to tell y'all. My bad, I'm slobbing and shit. God damn. Nigga, be fuck the money. We got our souls still. Right. You got Stephen A and all these fucking puppets sending this man hate. Dude, why they got y'all focused on Kyrie? All around the world is protesting. All around the world, the government is crashing. Y'all still listening to Sleepy Doe? The nigga's a demon. Y'all still listening to him? <laughs> oh, that nigga don't even... Is he even human? <laughs> you have telling you. There is no... Right now, they said in China, it's an energy crisis. All in the UK has been protesting nonstop shit happening in the UK. Y'all heard what was happening over there in Africa. Right now in the United States, in, in Texas, y'all suffering from more floods, ain't y'all? Yet they got everybody focused on Kyrie. It's it's starting to snow on the West Coast. I hope y'all prepared for this deadly ass cold weather over here on the West Coast. I am too. They said it was blizzards in Montana. The fuck? They said October 18th is the deadline for fireworkers to get the... In Seattle? You know how much shit is popping right now when they got y'all focused on Kyrie? That's fucked. See how they control y'all mind, bro? And Kyrie know all this shit that's happening. Y'all, it's new energy here on the planet. This shit is over. These niggas shouldn't even be playing sports right now. They literally are distracting y'all. Remember when I told y'all they was talking about China and the Olympics? And I told y'all a few miles away from the Olympics, it's nothing but floods and death in China? Remember? Everything they tell y'all on the news is a lie. And then when you start trying to speak any truth, you can have a motherfucking little brother or sister who got the shot. And they might have some side effects that was kind of like not promoted on the media. They might get a little sick. Try to try to tell that shit on, on, on your social media. They going to ban your ass. You can't say nothing negative right now. All these fucking celebrities is literally selling you out. They ain't getting no shot, bitch. You can go on the dark web and buy a car <laughs> right now. If you paid, you know how to use nature, and your family is already situated, you can sit back and just watch all these people just get tested on. You ain't got to participate at all. Most of the people that's telling you, like, listen, no celebrity want to get all the backlash and hate for coming out speaking on some doctor shit. So when they do, and you know they ain't got no business talking about it, they got paid. If they try to pay me 20000 how much you think they trying to pay them? Facts. I ain't go. It was like fifteen. I, I I could find an email if y'all wanted. Dude, listen. It is a battle. They probably it's deleted that joint. My birthday passed October fourth. My power went out in my fucking house. My car was stuck in a garage. Jeez. I couldn't do nothing. Oh my god! It just gosh. happened randomly. Two days later, I got into a car accident. A fucking a little accident. Leaving the gym, I was training these fucking females. It was some bot shit. I already dropped the video on my third channel. I've been going through nothing but spiritual attacks. Nothing but negative energy. That's outside of me trying to attack me. So if I was to like literally open myself up or lower my vibration, niggas would try to clone me or body snatch me or something, bro. Dead ass. If I wasn't on my guards right now, they trying to clone niggas, man. They trying to get people up out of here. Anybody that's not going along with the script, they trying to get your ass up out of here before 2022. So if you like, listen, one of the chosen ones, bring your ass back on YouTube and serve your purpose. Don't keep talking about this. Speak your truth. Wake people up. The more hate you get, more people wake up. The more negativity you get, more people wake up. Mm. More religious people watch me than spiritual, but I'm a spiritual YouTuber. It's nothing they can do about us. We glitches in the matrix. That nigga Kyrie is a glitch in the matrix, bro. 
He's a glitch. And they on his ass. On it. Matrix. Get back, serve your purpose. Keep spreading your fucking truth. Don't delete your channel. Don't, don't, don't take your because I know I got the I got the ability to inspire and motivate you and get you back on your shit. I know it. Get your ass back here. It's a war. Kyrie not the only motherfucker going through battle. He probably the biggest, but he's not the only one. We all in this shit together. Facts. I'm trying to tell you, it's a lot of fucking people, millions and millions of people waiting for us to fall. They attacking us conscious niggas right now. It's going to come up on the time y'all ain't going to even really see none of us on YouTube no more. Mm-mm. We're going to disappear. Bring your ass back out here. Raise your vibration. Keep taking care of yourself. Keep eating healthy and keep stocking up on food. I just, I just found out before I wrap this video up. All in the United States right now, and it's been trending, y'all can look this up. Owners of stores, grocery stores, saying it's like a one-month delay for them to get goods and shit. They talking about how it's cargoes all on the lakes and all on the, the oceans that's not filled <laughs> with food that's not going into the grocery stores. Remember I told y'all that food going to be expired. It's going to be farm workers last year. It's going to be a big... Now they just got food all on the oceans and shit and cargoes. It was a shortage in farm workers last year. Now it's a shortage in healthcare workers in New York and all around. It's happening naturally. Now it's about to be a shortage in fire workers. But they still got y'all focused on Kyrie. What do sports and basketball have to do with anything? The fuck? Fuck! Take care of yourself, man. Stay woke. Keep taking care of yourself. Yeah, Rome, Squan. Yeah, just definitely take take all that within, you know. Do your research, for sure. Do your research, you know. Don't don't believe everything off the ear, you feel me? But yeah, uh, yeah, so, so got some good points, bro. He really do. That's tough, you feel me? And then all that, all that food on the cargoes, bro. That 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 stuff's gonna expire before it get over. When it does get over here, it's gonna be expired. You're gonna have to throw all that away. You feel me? But now nah, he has some great points, y'all. Y'all just stay humble and just be easy. You feel me? I see you guys again.